I'm Matt Bauer from My Computer Works, and thanks for watching this video in our How My Computer Works series. This week's video will focus on more tips for using Microsoft Outlook. In case you missed my first three videos on Outlook, you can check them out here, here, or here, or you can click any of the links in the More Info section just under this video. This is Outlook Part 4. BCC Line if you've ever wanted to include someone when sending an email, but you don't want other recipients to know you are including this person, you can just type that person's email address in the BCC line. To enable the BCC line in a new message, just click the Options tab, then Show BCC. You can then type the recipient in this line and send your message like you normally would. BCC stands for Blind Carbon Copy, so when recipients receive your message, they will not see the recipient you entered in the BCC line. Contact Groups You can actually separate your contacts into several different groups in Outlook. First, click the Contacts section. Then click File New Folder Type a name for the folder, then click OK. The group then appears on the left side here. You can then click and drag your contacts into the folder like this. To select more than one contact at a time, Hold down the control key while selecting. Then drag just one of them into the group. When creating a new message, you can select the contacts from their respective groups with the drop down menu shown here. Calendar Recurrence When you schedule appointments, meetings, tasks, or pretty much anything in Outlook, you can set them to reschedule automatically. For example, you may need to do this if you have a monthly meeting on the same day and time each month. To do this, just click the Calendar section, then click File, New, Appointment, Meeting Request, or Task. Fill out the fields as you normally would, Then click the Recurrence button. You will then see all available options for repeating the meeting request, appointment, or task. You can set any number of options from a daily, weekly, monthly, or yearly reminder to a final ending date. Then just click OK, then save and close the appointment, meeting request, or task. I'll cover more Outlook features and tips in a future video, but if you have any training suggestions or ideas, go ahead and send them to training at mycomputerworks.com or just post them in the comments section below. If you'd like to subscribe to our My Computer Works YouTube channel, you can click the subscribe button just above any one of our YouTube video pages. You can also find us on Facebook and Twitter by clicking either of the links in the More Info section just under this video. If you have any questions about My Computer Works or would like to know more information about our services, you can go ahead and call the number you see below or just visit us online at mycomputerworks.com. My name is Matt Bauer. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.